are here on BBC Two. Before that, of course, it's this lot. Tonight, Compo takes me for a spin in a car from his youth. Richard tries to drive a fast car without crashing. And Lewis Hamilton faces his toughest test yet, the Suzuki Liana. Now, you ready for this? The Americans have announced their green car of the year. Oh, good, it'll be a Toyota Prius. So it isn't. Move. Electric it's thing? It's nope. a Prius Toyota. No. Nope. It's going to be a Prius, so... It isn't. I've got a photograph of it here. There you go. That's not a Prius. No, that's Whoa. a six-litre V8 Chevy Tahoe. <laughs> that's a green car I'm of the year. I'm absolutely not joking. Uh, no, it's a hybrid. They put a tiny, weeny little electric motor in it somewhere. There you are, that's a hybrid. And they've fallen for it. Does 21 miles to the gallon. That's green. It is very green. Actually, the funniest thing is the judges for this, OK? Do you want to hear the judges are? The American green car of the year. One of them was um, Jay Leno. Oh, he hates cars. Yes, oh, apart yeah. from his large collection of Ferraris mm. and Porsches, he hates them. Yeah. Uh, Carol Shelby. Oh, really hates them. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> yeah. No, Carol Shelby was the man who put the seven-litre uh, V8 in the ACAs to create the Cobra and spends his time now... Supercharging Mustangs. He does, yes. He puts superchargers on Mustangs. And the other judge was... Um, he's called Jean-Michel Cousteau. And he's actually Jacques Cousteau's son. I'd love to have been in the you know, when they were discussing it. <laughs> Shut up, you goddamn Frenchy cheese eating surrender monkey. Poor bloke, when he walked in that room, it's yeah. going to be very exciting. I'm a judge, and they were there drinking petrol and supercharging their chair. <laughs> <laughs> Shelby would be going, I don't know what a hybrid is, it's like country and western. <laughs> <laughs> now, uh, this here is the Honda. FCX Clarity, all right? Now, this has, ready? Collision mitigation braking. Brakes. So, yes. They, they call it. <laughs> you actually analyse what collision mitigating, uh, mitigating braking system means. It doesn't mean brakes. However, this is one of the most important cars ever launched. It's actually got a hydrogen fuel cell, so the only thing that comes out of the back of that, the, all that comes out is water, H2O, that's it. It's completely zero emissions, it's, it's really astonishing. The hydrogen fuel cells are actually extremely clever, much better than batteries, because mm. the, uh, the fuel cell stack in that develops 100 kilowatts. No, it is, and that's, well, that would be enough well, like for your house. Yeah, well, it would be 100 electric fires, but in my house, I mean, even if you put lots of stuff on, like the immersion heater, the cooker, the telly, the central heating... Your electric the, curlers. My ele yeah, my electric curlers. <laughs> my gramophone. And the giant flashing illuminated neon picture of Freddie Mercury. Yes. All of that. <laughs> on. Um, so that, that was, would add up to what? Well, no more than ten. No, exactly. and the point of this car is that not only is it a proper car, drives around like a normal car, but if you could plug that into your house, well, it would actually power a whole street. Easily. And yeah. only produce water. The only real problem is that, we, well, the only thing that we haven't got yet is a hydrogen filling station. And the other thing, of course, is that height storing hydrogen is tricky, but they're working yeah. on ways to make it so you can store it on bits of metal. And actually, that brings me on to something. Children, if you're watching, um, school tomorrow, if you've got a science lesson and the teacher says, today we're going to do storage of hydrogen, pay attention, because whoever works that out is going to be the richest person the world has ever seen. Ever. Because, honestly, when as soon as they get the infrastructure worked out, that's just it. Yep. So if you're watching this in Saudi Arabia... <laughs> 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 Time to break out your camel. <laughs> it's back to carpets for you. <laughs> <laughs> right, there, that's the end of the news, uh, so let's move it on. Um...